jealous. <laughs> no, but seriously, you guys, I mean, if, if you guys need anything, mm -hmm. any help, I got your back. Do it. Hi, this is Rocio from Entertainment Affair, and I'm here with... Alex Galan, I'm writer-director of the film. Uh, John Paul Medrano, I play Victor Sanchez. Uh, my name is Jaita Maciel Barrera, and I'm playing Fernando. My name is Luis Quintana, and I play Mr. H. My name is Shane Warren, and I play Woody. So tell me how you guys came up with this idea of this movie. Well, the original idea was a short film that we did in, back in 2013, um, and you know, uh, Juan and Woody they were in the um, in the short, and then uh, eventually the uh, short went to the Cannes Festival in a small category, and then we had a lot of attention there, and I was able to get funds from Mexico City and some uh, funds from LA, and that's how it was worked. And if you guys can tell me a little bit about each of your characters and. Uh, well, I mean, for, for Woody, for my character, I uh, honestly, I used to walk around in L.A. with a cowboy hat, pretty much the cowboy country look, that's just how I am and where I'm from, and Alex kind of just told me to be me, <laughs> so I just kind of brought myself to it, but uh, yeah, other than that, I honestly did not really have to change my character that much because I kind of just played myself in the movie. <laughs> not me being more in the, the mindset of the, you know, the, the douchey wannabe <laughs> Kind of tough guy, you know. Like I mean, they made me watch. He made me watch like uh, different movies, like uh, Tu Mamá También or um, Goodfellas. And yeah, like basically just um, what I always do is just uh, get in the mindset, just like imagine it, play it in my head, and then I play it over and over again, and then until I get the feel about it, and then just action. In my case, uh. I didn't see this character really different from who I am, so basically like Woody, I feel like I, we were like meant to be, both Fernando and me, because mm -hmm. if you can notice in the movie, uh, Fernando is the type of friend that likes to be half his friends back, you know, he cares a lot about them, and that's basically how I am in real life also with my friends and, you know, family, I'm always like caring and I want to, you know, make sure they're always safe and good, so... I felt like, you know, it was meant to be both Fernando and Hyde to meet up at so you want to be against it. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I got picked because I don't know anything about being a gangster, but I'm pretty sure I look like a gangster. <laughs> um, and I had worked with Alex prior to So You Want to Be a Gangster in a short film called What's in the Case? Yeah. And I think from, from that performance, it upgraded to I, I uh, Mr. Asian to... Yeah. I wrote the part for him. Yeah. 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 So you're not similar to your character, so how do you prepare for your character? Um, how do you prepare to be a gangster? Yeah. Um, that's the movie, you have to go watch it. Um, but I also agree that <laughs> the, uh, the script... Go. It's in the name, <laughs> it, it's even in the name. You have to, yeah, I watched the movie, I made the movie, so now I know how to, you know, rise up into being a gangster. But uh, it's a fun script, it was a fun script, so... Definitely. Yeah, yeah. just go with it and yeah. The lines will make you look tough, I guess. <laughs> uh, how long did it take from like writing it until it was done? And it was like three years and a half, like the whole thing. Yeah, yeah. From you know writing the script, then you know developing, reproduction, production, post production, and then uh, from festivals and then put it out there. Yeah, three years and a half. Your hat is awesome. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah, man, yeah. It's, it's like a masterpiece. I, I love it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's very exciting to have it out there because yeah. 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 it's been so many years. Yeah. 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 It's a big yeah. step in the right direction. Uh, where did you guys film this? Like, how long did it took to film it, and how how was the process of that? We shot the movie here in LA for three weeks. It was downtown, uh, Hollywood, Burbank, Studio City, all over the place here in LA. Just the places. Place. That desert. <laughs> yeah, what was uh, that? Oh, store? yes, that time of the yeah. desert. Yeah. Oh, the warehouse was amazing. The warehouse, yeah. Any fun. constraints, limitations? Fun stories? Uh, <laughs> there, there were there some bloopers. I mean, there, um, there was a a scene where you know they they kidnap us and they put us in the van. But there was like during one shot, there's like, where's the key? Uh, some, where's the key? I can't open the door. Where's the key? I need the key. Yeah, because uh, I, I, I love big fun yeah, of long takes. Uh, I love long takes, but if they make sense, right? So in this movie, we have a lot of action scenes that they're like I don't know two minutes or three minutes without cut. 
So you know the cast and the crew, nobody can like mess up because you know we have to repeat the whole thing. Yeah. yeah. And in that shot, like everything worked perfectly. But whenever they're gonna be opening the car, it was locked. It's like oh, oh you know, so like, God, then go back, go back, go back, come on, come on, don't, 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 don't cut, don't cut, like a tail slate. Yeah. So that was a fun, that was a fun one. Uh, what was the easiest to work with and the hardest? Oh. <laughs> <laughs>